Welcome to today's edition of MQTT Monday. I'm excited to talk about one of my favorite MQTT 5 features, user properties. These UTF-8 string key value pairs can be added as a header to almost all MQTT packets. Ping response and ping request, the only two packets that are exempt. When the Oasis TC asked MQTT users about feedback and possible shortcomings of the protocol, a lack of extensibility was often mentioned. This is why this technically very simple feature got introduced. Possible practical applications include adding information about the payload to your packet, making it much more efficient to process said data. Additionally, you could think about adding an extra layer of routing on the application level. If you think about an application that might receive different types of data, one of which is used for live displaying, while another type is used to, for long-term storage, with the use of the MQTT user properties feature, the application can very quickly within the header of the packet already know what to do with this type of data. And probably the most common use case that I have seen so far for this feature is traceability. With user properties, it is now possible to include information about the sender to your packet, even though MQTT is using a publish subscribe paradigm. In conclusion, the user properties feature is technically rather simple, but offers near unlimited possibilities. I'm very excited to hear about your use of the feature in the comments. Subscribe to the channels and learn more about additional MQTT5 features. Thank you.